Hey everybody, Brandon here from iDub Hockey, and today I'm here to help you on how to properly size an ice hockey pant at home. So what you're gonna wanna do is grab a soft measuring tape. If you don't have a soft measuring tape, you can just use a piece of string and then measure that. And then you're gonna wanna measure the circumference of your waist just above the hips. And then after you found that, you're gonna take your waist measurement and your height and then find your corresponding size on our general sizing guideline chart. Now in my case, I'm 5'6", at a 33 inch waist, so that's gonna put me in between a senior small and a medium. Uh, you might be the same as me, where you're uh, in between two sizes. This is gonna come down to personal preference. The smaller pant will be closer to the body in fit, and then the larger pant will offer more volume, but also more protection and coverage too. I also wanna mention that a lot of pants have a length adjustment system today. So you'll see a zippered extension system around the waist that allows the pant to extend. This is gonna be a great option for that taller, skinnier player who needs a smaller waist, but more length. Uh, this is also a great option for players who are growing in between seasons, uh, allows them to keep the pant for an extra season or two. Also, be sure to remember that different brands have different sizing guidelines, so make sure you're always uh, referencing their sizing chart on the product page. All right, now it's time to look at what a properly fitting ice hockey pant looks like. So the first area is gonna be the upper portion. It should maintain a secure fit around your waist without being too tight or too loose. Uh, it sits on your waist, not your hips. A lot of players are wearing them too low uh, because up top is your kidney protection. So that needs to be up top, maintaining that coverage and protection to your kidneys. And then the second area is gonna be the end of the pant. So that one, you wanna have it overlapping your thigh protection of your shin guard without overlapping the kneecap. A pant that's too small is gonna be way too constrictive around the waist, so it's gonna inhibit your range of motion and your mobility. And then down low, this is gonna be the main area of concern. The end of the pant is not gonna seal the gap in protection between your, your shin guard. So as you're taking a stride, your pant will ride up. And so if it's too small, gonna, there's gonna be an exposed gap in protection. Lastly, a pant that's too large is not gonna maintain a secure fit around the waist, which means it can twist and turn during gameplay, which is not good because it's not gonna offer you good coverage and protection. And then down low, the end of the pant will overlap your kneecap of the shin guard, which means they're gonna interfere with one another, uh, might even snag, so you're not gonna get full range of motion during gameplay. Uh, it's gonna feel really uncomfortable as well. Now you're ready to start shopping for an ice hockey pant. Click the link in the description so you can check out our wide selection available. If you're interested in more information on how to select the right model and fit profile, we have a video on our learning center which is located on our website. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe so you can stay updated on all the latest incoming hockey gear.